Hey there, it's Kimberly Lott. I'm a business coach and energy healer for entrepreneurs who want to make more money and magic doing what they love. And so if that sounds like you, you're in the right place. And today we're actually going to do some energy healing for the throat chakra. And so actually, as I was picking out my outfit, I just got like mermaid vibes for some reason, like this top seems a little sailory to me. So I was like, oh, mermaid. And I was like, oh my God, Ariel, the little mermaid. And I was thinking about how, you know, she loses her voice in the movie, which, you know, for better or for worse, I don't think that that was great conditioning for women, but <laughs> she lost her voice in the movie and it was something that she had to regain. And I think a lot of us energetically can lose our voice in life or in business and just feel like, oh, I'm not really saying what I need to say. I don't feel like I'm saying what I truly mean or what I truly want to say. Maybe we're not being as open or as honest as we want to be. And, you know, this is a great practice to come back to anytime you feel like, hey, like there's a little gunk in my throat, like energetically something is stuck there or I can't actually open it up enough for me to feel like I am using my full voice. And so the first thing that we're going to do is something that I did for the first time a few months ago with one of my energy healing clients. And it was interesting because I hadn't done it previously and I've been doing energy healing for a few years now. And it's something that I wasn't taught. It just kind of came through intuitively. And it's something that I think might look a little weird. And so again, if you've you know done any sort of energy healing before, this is probably not going to look anything like that. I also want to put a disclaimer here because if you have a really strong gag reflex, and I don't think you should do it in the way that I'm going to demonstrate, but let me just <laughs> fill you in on what I'm talking about. So we're actually going to open the mouth like this like a nice gentle open and you're gonna plunge the energy with one of your fingers or maybe multiple fingers if that feels okay for you and plunging. So what are we doing really? So I call this the energetic plunger. It's again, something that came through me in an energy healing session a few months ago and I felt called to share it with you guys just in case any throat energy gets stuck for you. And so just go at your own pace if you have a strong gag reflex, I'm gonna reiterate, don't go too hard on this and you can even do it outside of the mouth, but I'm gonna demonstrate and just keep an open mind, okay? So we open the mouth, maybe take a deep breath in and stick one or two fingers in just slightly, gently, lightly, and you're not gonna to touch anything in particular, but you're just gonna energetically plunge like this, okay? and maybe pull stuff out, maybe not, but just like energetically plunging. And so what I feel when I do this on myself or when I do it with other people is I feel like it's helping the energy get unstuck. So similar to what we would do with a toilet or anything else that needs a little bit of plumbing to get the unclogging action going is we're breaking up energy. We're just letting it break up in the mouth and in the throat area. And so you don't even have to stick it that far inside. And like I said, it's like you have, you know, any sort of weird reactions to that type of motion, just don't do it. Don't do it. It's okay. You can just do it like outside of the mouth like this. And I still feel the same effects. Like it's like you're breathing and somehow the energy is like pulsing as you breathe. And so I invite you to try that. We're going to do about a minute together and then you can do it on your own or, you know, in your own space or timing, you know, maybe you're in your public area right now and it's okay if you're not doing this with me, but just notice how it feels to even just observe it. And so we're going to do about a minute. So just breathing in, you can breathe in through the mouth as it's like open. It's probably easier to feel the energetic pulses if you do that. So maybe starting with a deep inhale in through the mouth out through the mouth and then gently pulsing as you inhale on the next inhale in. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And maybe closing the eyes as you do this. Inhale. Exhale. about three more rounds of this. Exhale. Twice more.
once more. And so if you're yawning, that's totally normal and also a great throat opener. So yawning is totally fine and normal for this. And again, this energetic plunger technique is something that I use when I feel like things are just really clogged or stuck and just not moving. So if you ever feel like you need it, of course, maybe go to the bathroom and do it so people don't think you're trying to make yourself, you know, bomb or anything like that. But <laughs> just notice how it feels after the fact. And if this is something that you want to carry in your energy healing toolbox, you're more than welcome to come back to it and revisit the practice. I love to help people open this area of the body a lot because it's such a beautiful connection between, you know, the head space and the heart space. And I think it's something that Honestly, if it gets constricted or closed off, a lot of weird issues can start to crop up. And so you want to make sure that it's just nice and open, as open as it can be. And so as we close today, maybe placing your hands on the outsides of the neck and just letting the energy kind of move up and out. So maybe you massage this area just a bit. And this actually activates the vagus nerve as well, which is kind of like a two for one technique. Just letting the neck feel a little more open, a little less constricted as we close today. And then maybe even widening the energy out so you can take your fingertips like this and widen out. Widen the throat energy and the throat capacity. <sighs> Beautiful. And again, if you're yawning like me, you can take the energy out as you yawn on the exhale and that's clearing stuff out of your throat. And so if you love this video and want more practices like this, let me know in the comments below. And if you want to receive these videos in your inbox every single week, get on my email list. The link to subscribe is down below and you get a bunch of welcome gifts and it's just such a great inbox party. So if you want in, subscribe. I'll see you on the inside and thank you so much for being here and for watching and for energy healing with me today. I'll catch you in the next video. Ciao for now. Bye.